All right, guys, so we caught quite a few Sierra mackerel out here today, so we're gonna fillet them up. We're gonna have one back at the resort tonight, and uh, we're gonna give the other ones to the mate. And what I'm using here is a Smith's Products knife. This is a nine inch knife, stainless steel, super sharp. You can see it just slices right through that mackerel. Look at that. Whoop. At least it fell on the skin side. See that there? You can take that and throw it on the grill. You leave the skin on it, you could also bake it. Just holds the meat together a little bit better. You want to take that stomach lining out because that's no bueno. There you go. That's what that Sierra mackerel fillet looks like. And again, I use the nine inch Smith product stainless steel fillet knife. It has a really nice grip. Real, you know, you can just tell that it's not going to be slippery if it's wet. I really like the way it feels in my hands. For a fish like this, I would typically like a knife that's not so stiff. This is what I would use for like a dolphin or a bigger snapper or something. I have a more flexible one in the room, but I forgot it there, so I'm using the bigger knife right now. There's your other filet. Let's come right down there. There's bones in there as well. So I'm feeling my way behind those bones. So I'm being real careful. You want all that out of there. All right. Other side. Look at this fillet again. Real good look at this one. That's a pretty one there. I'm gonna cut that stomach lining out just like I did with the other ones. Now you're gonna do the bottom half. You don't really have to just slides these fish so easy. 